Much needed federal funding could be on the way for what some say, say is a much needed new public safety building in Owasso. City leaders tell TV5's James Felton why a new facility is so desperately needed. It's a game changer. Owasso Public Safety Director Kevin Lenkart might have a brand new facility to work in soon. Our city was very happy about uh, being notified by uh, Representative Slotkin's office and Senator Peters' office that between the two of them, we have been allotted $14.5 million through congressional appropriations uh, for the purchase, or I'm sorry, for the building of a new public safety building. The current public safety building has been around since 1969. Lenkart tells us it's too small for the number of staff here and that there are no facilities for women. What it means for our staff and our city personnel just to be able to have a modern facility uh, that's not 53 years old. Owasso Mayor Rob Teich says the current building was not built for Michigan. He tells us it has no insulation, just one of the reasons he believes it's time for a new facility. This building will have uh, now uh, will be obviously uh, up to date uh, technology wise. Uh, the doors will be the proper size or it's got this proper width, height, so forth, or we can get bigger trucks and so forth. Uh, in here, I mean, equipment does change through the years. Now, Lenkhart will wait and hope the federal funding for the new public safety building is approved by Congress as part of its government spending bill for the new fiscal year. We do know it's a long process, but we're excited for the future. This is a, a, a very big uh, deal here for our department and for the city of Owasso. James Felton, WNEM TV5. If all goes to plan, construction on the new public safety building would begin in 2024.